I see a bunch of people posting rich kid check. I think that's pretty lame. I want to see people starting a business. So we can start the new trend as business check or hustle check. Let's do it. If I see another small business check with bitches selling lip glosses or eyelashes, listen, be creative. Can't y'all think of something else to buy in bulk? Stop doing that shit. Oh my. Calling all small business owners. Show me everything that you have in stock right now. Everything that you have ready to go, ready for people to purchase and be shipped out. There's no better person to promote your business than yourself. So let's do this. Take this video and show us what you got. Calling all small business owners. Show me everything that you have in stock right now. Everything that you have ready to go, ready for people to purchase and be shipped out. There's no better person to promote your business than yourself. So let's do this. Take this video and show us what you got. Calling all small business owners. Show me everything that you have in stock right now. Everything that you have ready to go, ready for people to purchase and be shipped out. There's no better person to promote your business than yourself. So let's do this. Take this video and show us what you got. Calling all small business owners. Show me everything that you have in stock right now. Everything that you have ready to go, ready for people to purchase and be shipped out. There's no better person to promote your business than yourself. So let's do this. Take this video and show us what you got. Calling all small business owners. Show me everything that you have in stock right now. Everything that you have ready to go, ready for people to purchase and be shipped out. There's no better person to promote your business than yourself. So let's do this. Take this video and show us what you got. Calling all small business owners. Show me everything that you have in stock right now. Everything that you have ready to go, ready for people to purchase and be shipped out. There's no better person to promote your business than yourself. So let's do this. Take this video and show us what you got. This is what my team boss babe pen pal gave me. Face mask, a little pouch, a really cute letter, a pack of Oreos, I love them, and a lip balm. If you guys want to be part of this project next time, follow us on all right, business owners, show us where your packaging stuff is from. Let's help people out. Some people are starting off the way we were starting off at one point. So let's show them in the right direction. Show them where you get your packaging stuff from and show some love. 
let's pack an order so basically she asked me to do it on tiktok so hey girl this is our hoodie order we got me and my grandma putting on hand sanitizer of course so then we got the hoodie we got the little tag on it she put the tag on it which i'm currently obsessed with then we got our tbb circle sticker from avery then we put it on the wrapping of course we had to do double because it was a sweater um and then i got all the free stuff which is the free pin and the free stickers i got those into it so right now you get three free stickers with every order so i threw that in and then i put the little tbb circle sticker then i do the thank you card of course the little packing slip and i put it in the middle just so everything is protected inside package it up and it's going to be sent out hey guys this is a day in my life as a teen entrepreneur as you can see here going on ipad dming everyone that follows us we try our best sometimes we get blocked by instagram but that's what i was doing here then i got up got ready so today i'm actually going to my grandma's house so did my hair lip gloss skincare all that um and then i got packed my bag which is my computer basically i take it because i work over here in my bag got ready hide your flask let's go on my way i got here had coffee and breakfast love my nespresso machine guys best investment in the world got my printer i was actually having issues with it so i was a little bit annoyed but it worked um it started printing i put hand sanitizer look at the little sticker i started packing orders um, so i had about seven or eight orders today so that's kind of what i was doing today as a business owner um i did all that you could see all the orders i was packaging them did a little fast clip because that's really cool packaged the order and then i got it all ready and i took them to the post office and yeah that was my day bottle oh, i can't let you down now that i got it all i need is to be struck by your electric light Hear me out. I wanted to be like this, like this, and like that. That was my goal. And let me tell you, six months later, since I started my business, that is me now. My goals back then and me right now. I never fuck the lane cause I'm allergic. I like to flirt with pretty ass niggas, make them nervous. I don't fuck with niggas that be liking or be jerking. Honestly, I can't dance, but on a mouth, I be twerking. Titties on fleek with a bitch on my head. Hey everyone, this is a story of how I nearly got scammed by someone in America. As you can see, it's all packaged up. I've just uh, scribbled out because I don't want to put her address up. And then I've put my return address on the back. Anyway, she tried to make me a payment via Cash App and she said she can't do it. Then she said she'll do it via Western Union and I waited patiently. And then she was like, I couldn't do it as well. And then she asked me, can I ship it? And then she can send and then she will make the payment which is, of course, a no-no. I then told her she can make the payment via my website because it has launched, and she said okay, and until now, she has not replied. I've opened the package, and because she spent quite a lot of money with me, and these are the things that she bought from me. Uh, so she bought these two rings, and I decided to give her an anklet and a necklace for free. You know, I always try to give back to anyone who buys from me, and this is what I get. I don't know why. <laughs> Pressing mass is just a little bit different. Go ahead and up that pressure nice and high and pre-press for seven seconds. Applying heavy pressure ensures that the mask is nice and flat and the design will make it to all the edges and corners. Then after that, go ahead and flip your mask onto the design and place it where you want to be. Then you want to apply heat resistant tape to make sure the design does not move and stays where you need it to be. Go ahead and flip it back over and apply another piece of parchment paper on top and press for 60 seconds. After you do that, you'll be able to find that the design was able to make it to all the edges and the corners with no problem. If you find the one, you should never give her up. I think it's the way life changes when in love, yeah.